welcome back to my channel. We are um, in the fishing or pocket fishing kit series right now, and we are making a fishing kit or a pocket fishing kit with a Coca Cola bottle. This is a 12 ounce bottle, it's not a full size bottle. Um, and we are also putting in this kit a yo yo trap. And this is a trap or an engine for a trap that is going to help us, hopefully, to catch fish. And the best thing about this trap is you set it and you leave it. You don't have to worry about it once you've set it. Um, you can check. You can just check it. You don't have to set it and watch it. It will do pretty much all the work for you. So in this kit, we have um, 12 pound fishing line and 6 pound fishing line. We're staying with that with those sizes because they work. Um, some bank line that we can tie off to the yo-yo trap onto a branch or a limb or however we are going to rig that. Two bobbers, one smaller and one larger. Some fishing swivels. And these are heavy duty fishing swivels. This one has a clip on it and this one does not. And we also have an assortment of hooks ranging from size 8 all the way up to some larger sizes so that we can target different size fish. This trap, or this engine for the trap, can catch um, anything from smaller fish to catfish. If you go online or if you go on YouTube and just um, search um, yo-yo trap fishing or fishing with a yo-yo trap, you can see many different uses for this. Sigma 3 Survival School, he has um, a lot of, or a few different videos on how to rig this, um, which, which is a good reference, but you can catch fairly large fish with this trap. And also I just have a rubber band um, to latch the trap to the bottle when I'm storing it and the plastic bag to keep all of our gear in. Now, we're going to open our bottle. Uh, we do not, we're not going to bring any bait with us in this kit. We can, but we've decided against it. We're going to take our fishing line, put it in this bag, swivels, bag, hooks, bag, bank line, uh, we'll save that. <laughs> we'll save that. And oh, one thing, um, a ranger band, which can be used for starting fires, for holding things, um, whichever needs. We're going to pack that down, press all the air out and seal it, roll it up good and tight, and push it through here. This is going to be a little bit tricky to get out, but with a little work, you'll be able to get it out no problem. Now this bigger bobber does not fit in here. I have a way to rig that later. Um, the smaller bobber does. So that's everything that's going on the inside of this kit. You can put a knife in this kit if you want to, a small pocket knife, if you feel that you want to, but we are not going to. Okay, so I have, like I said, some bank line and a small rubber band. We're going to take this rubber band and we're going to hook the bobber to that. Just like that. Then we're going to take our bank line, feed it through the rubber band, and feed our bank line through the yo-yo trap. Let's see which end fits through it better. And there are already cut holes in the yo-yo trap. <coughs> For that reason, okay, so push that down. Now we're going to take this, whoop, sorry, we're going to take this, slide that down, and we're going to tie this, and then we're going to tie these two ends together, I'm sorry, tie these two ends together, and then we're going to take both of these, we're going to wrap this around the top, just like so. I'm just going to keep wrapping it, wrap it, and wrap it again. And now, we've got that. We're going to take this large rubber band that we have, we're going to essentially do the same thing. We're going to wrap this twice around the yo-yo trap. So now our kit is fastened and it's together. It does make a little bit of noise, but it's not too bad. Um, small, simple, easy, and effective. So 
there you guys have it. That is another pocket fishing kit that we made out of a soda bottle in conjunction with a yo-yo trap. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next video.